that fine. Well, I see so oh, many people really. after we've gone in and like decimated in places in DCS, like, oh, and they go in with a Huey dropping off cargo and men six days to take over enemy air bases and stuff, you know, and blue flag and DC and need, um, you know? one and fourth and that. Because you can't hide from the horde, it's fucking stupid. I always just dig to the bottom of the map. So, it's the very bottom. I thought. Yeah, does it work? This might be good. Yeah, but it's okay for a while. Eh, uh, what? Could you leave me to the Welcome to the Cadet now. Start lesson, Cadet. Today we will practice starting up the Huey and getting get ready for you. flight. Press the space bar when you're you are ready to begin. Alright, go on then. Get on with it. Before we begin, press right control and C to close the cockpit doors. Hmm. First, we need to provide electrical power to the aircraft. This can mm -hmm. be done with the help of the ground crew, but we'll use onboard power. Why don't you just build up? Take yeah. a look at the overhead console. To hell with the ground crew. On the oh, AC oh, power oh, 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 One of those like big, like the consumer buildings with the two stories and the roof area. One you thing get I to. always like to do. And I'll fortify the bottom so they can't get through set it that on one. the uh, bottom side of it. To on my the one twisty building. thing on the top of my And then the other building will be the exit with all the traps and shit. Control panel, set the AC yeah, phase over, voltmeter like, selector the switch to AC, and the inverter Barely switch uh, labeled IMVTR uh, to off. Now on the DC power control panel, set the main generator switch to on, and the DC voltmeter selector switch to ESS bus, essential bus. Mm -hmm. but, um, Next, set the starter generator switch to start and turn on the battery. I have 547 games. Don't worry, that that's play. just the low RPM warning blare, which is normal right now. The games that I have in Press my the library. low RPM audio switch no, to acknowledge the warning. Fortnite, what David wants everyone to get. No, Let's also free. test the caution lights panel well, to make sure all of the lights you. are operative. You see, Set Gattel, and hold the test switch that? in the down position. Make sure all of the, of the caution lights are on. Would, so. Done that? Yeah. yeah, David, you piece of shit. I never said I would. Yeah, I've done I that. Maybe. Next, on the engine exactly. control panel, like set the main fuel David switch to on and the governor now. switch to auto. Well, all other fuel switches should be off. Myself. On the miscellaneous you, um, control panel, Daisy, set no. the hydraulic control switch to on, Daisy the force strip on, switch to on, <laughs> and make sure the chip detector system again? is set to both. No, it's probably still shitty. Taste Before starting the engine, we need to make sure the throttle He's is set to idle. The throttle uh, is located the on the grip of the collective control find, handle the next to the pilot's left leg. Anywhere. The throttle I is am not touching his left leg! key to increase it, and right using the page down key to decrease it. Press and hold the page Alien down key isolation. for a few seconds to make sure the throttle twist grip on the collective control handle is set to the idle stop position. Also, make sure the stick and the pedals so are in the right. neutral position and you the collective is fully lowered. You can check the position Marines of the controls on the controls play. indicator oh, by pressing right control it's and so enter. Good. What are you talking about? Right control and enter. 12 hours hey. of it. Mostly because the, oh. the multiplayer as the alien is fantastic. Yeah, alright. Next. Garbage. I'll play Borderlands 2. I'll play Borderlands 2. That's installed right now, actually. Next. I'll be installed, but it won't take long. About 20 minutes. You guys want to do Borderlands run? I'll sure. probably get bored of it really fast. But yeah, probably. Have you got an OP8 yet? Or? I don't have. It. Come on, I've tried. I've I'm done my control and that now. Or before my fell out with time. This is the other people quit. Well, we got through the majority of the story, and then we kind of just stopped. You now we wanted to do all the DLC. It stopped. Well, Why is he stopped? Come I don't know on. How long this is gonna take. This is gonna take. It's then. ten gigs, so it's gonna take a while. Oh, I'm like installing it too. I've got six, it, David. five wow. minutes remaining on the ten gigs. Mine's not even yeah, that point yet. Ten. To start the engine, you will need to press and hold the home key on the I keyboard to pull the engine start be trigger like hours, located apparently. beneath the switch box of the collective control handle. As the engine spools up, so you will need to monitor the engine instruments and the clock. The engine start button needs to be held down until the gas producer like speed reaches 40% or 40 seconds have passed on the clock, like whichever comes first. One. You well, should also see the rotor begin to turn around 15% oh, of yeah, gas I'm producer RPM. Line, 
If this does not happen, abort the start sequence. I'm running it yeah. Whenever you're ready, begin the ignition sequence by pressing and holding the home key on the keyboard to pull the engine start trigger. I'm going to to note the time and watch the gas producer indicator. I'm watching, nothing's happening. How high up level did you get? 72? Absolutely uh, nothing's happening. I don't remember. Did you get into the OP levels? Maybe. I don't remember. It's been a while. 16. Oh, so it's home key, not left. Okay, it's in Borderlands 2. After Alton you get home. 70, then go to OP yeah. levels. I don't know, uh, dude. I am not a real key. dad, alright? I can't key. just do everything, okay? Engine start. <laughs> Definitely says you can home play key. Minecraft story mode. <laughs> I don't even have Minecraft. I've, I, 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 every once in a while I try to do, like, if I'm really, really bored and I don't have internet, I have a Minecraft and, like, a bunch of, like, adventuring shit on it, just, I never craft anything, I just run in and kill shit until I die, then I just quit. This most is not working, you know. I play dumb shit, like, uh, Sid Meier's Pirates, and I'll just play Pirates for, like, fucking 12 hours. <laughs> Cause it's Those awesome. are games that you don't expect to take all the time. Yep. Dead Rising 3. No, I really wanted to play with somebody, but... Time! Nobody ever wanted to play. I might reinstall Ark. Ark's such a fun game. game, though. Yeah, it's enormous. I like yeah, after all it. the updates, it's 80 plus gigs. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I have Scorched Earth. And Nothing's up, man. Yeah. Did you have to buy tech? <sighs> I don't remember, I quit. No, that was free, that was along with stuff. I quit soon after tech. There's also a new map, it's uh, Ragnarok, I guess that's the tech map. Oh, uh, that's a pretty old expansion, yeah, they just Ragnarok finally, uh... Like Hold of Home's fun. banned to something else. All right, and that's, Ragnarok um... is the old expansion, I believe. For the old No, nope, it's one of the newest... It's only been out. Yeah, it's the, uh, it's the okay. newest map, yeah. Right. No, that was Valhalla, that was Valhalla. That's, um... Mod map, a lot of, like, Go that was Valhalla. There. They have ports overall. And press that. Uh, yeah, okay. it's Swords, one of the yeah. most uh, versatile. So it's now on the whole test. The yeah, no shit. Press and hold that key. Uh, they've no also way, nerfed dude. flying. There's only to one now back. you should ever have. That's what you just need the mods to uh, put vanilla flyers. Yeah, you need to just, uh, you, all you need is a velociraptor, and I always name my velociraptor the exact same thing if it's a female. Clever girl. That's it. What? You is that too much? Is that dumb? Yeah. Jurassic Park, clever girl. You see, you can't set that to anything other than... It's like, how many hours do you have on ARC? Yeah, Pogo, That's how many on. hours do you have on ARC? That's on... I don't know, well over 100. Gas producer's not doing anything. 158. 1,200. Yeah, I know a buddy of mine who, do, who did that to, um... Gao, you remember Robinson? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Robinson was part of an Alva tribe and his shit. I don't even know. I didn't miss okay. something. I, I mean, we did forever. click I everything up here. About and 400 hours total. On our 180 on the PC on and the rest the SS of the bus. Until about Essential 700 bus. hours in, the uh, server on. owner decided he wasn't going to post it anymore. So there went 700 oh, hours of stuff. Maybe not. Main generator I hop on. around for the next uh, several hundred Battery hours. Battery on. I'm, I'm trying to find this guy because he had like some retarded start amount of gen hours. Start. I don't talk to him anymore. It's been a long time. Press the button down here. Press the switch. There you go. I remembered. Oh. Been on here over eight hours. Right, the carrot slice has started. The helicopter will toss you around quite a bit. Yeah, sorry guys, I, my uh, you know you need to use the bag. I use a 30 inch I TV, 32 inch TV for um, for the monitor on my streaming PC, and it switched off just before I saw you saying top panel, top panel. Sorry. Eight hours after that. So I can let go of this button now then. Well, why don't you use this one? Because we're up to 70%. Yeah. OK. 
hill. I think I'm gonna okay, have to. Okay, idling normally. Let's set up the avionics. Back on what? the overhead console. Yeah, I don't know turn on the inverter name. by setting yeah, it to main no on. Idea. I'm looking for it. We'll now power up the what radio systems. Shot, Set That's the AN movement, APX right? 72 Basically, transponder to standby, STBY, by, by right clicking straight. once over the master I was on switch. A, I was on a five -time server, I think Turn on the AN ARN 82 VHF NAVCOM radio by right clicking on the power switch yeah. once. Full, uh, Turn on the AN ARC 134 VHF COM radio by right clicking on the power switch once. Why did that? Turn on the AN ARC 51 BX UHF radio by setting the function switch well, to TR. Transmit receive. There's two transmitters. Set the interphone selector switch to 3 to set the VHF COM radio for transmission. This will allow you to communicate with ATC. To communicate with Wingman, you will usually transmit over the UHF radio, which is position 2 on this switch. Turn on the AN ARC 131 VHF FM radio by setting the mode switch to TR. Transmit the signal. Turn on the AN ARN 83 ADF receiver by setting the mode switch to ADF. We, me and one of my buddies. To complete the avionic setup, set the starter generator to standby by STD1 on the overhead console. Let's now run up the engine to the Can I switch the bloody radio off? Raise up repeatedly and monitor the engine and load it at the indicator as power increases. Forwards. Continue to slowly add power until the throttle grip on the collector is twisted and the to the mother's Watch the engine opening up to stabilize at 6600 and rotor opening up on 324. Where's the volume for the bloody radio? Right click with a test switch and master control. I can't hear you, dopey git! This one was just done, wasn't it? Dinos were like just. Yeah, it's not bugger. He had like two Rexes, he had a Pterodon, he had a bunch of other shit, and I was like, um. Yeah, these are mine now. <laughs> I'm taking all of these, so I proceeded to take all of them. Every single but one. But I do what next? Back to my house. It was like a fucking hour trip. A test again. And then, uh, if the engine RPM the is server, off the 6600 uh, mark, you can use the governor RPM Clearly, switch on the collective, also known as the beep switch, to adjust the RPM as necessary. We just kind of came on the helicopter fine. is now ready for takeoff. This concludes the cold start lesson. All All right. Well done. There we go. Now we can fly it then. And I think, or crash it. Honestly, we were having a great time. <laughs> we were honestly, all we were doing well, I held the button too long with that. Hey, see, you lot know how to fly this. Why are you getting me to fly the bloody thing? Pretty much at like max level shit. And they had not been on the server. <laughs> nice, nice girl. Just waiting to claim one of them, and then we went to the other server to wait to fuck around. So and this is the Huey then. Everything we could ever need ever without any. Effort. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah, this is worse than the bloody morning. Spitfire. I just gotta stop playing. Whoa! It's better than the bloody KA50 though. Oh! Wow! Zero. Well, no heads up display that I can use. Pretty max level, I think. Maybe not max, but pretty high up. It's like a level 68 or something like that. So, characters I have, I have a 65 siren. Oh, too much collective there then. Four zero. Uh, it's like with the endo guns are guns one at. Also, if you want. Yeah, I have like a, I have a couple characters. That's cool. We're flying. I have like a 40 Necromancer, like a 68 Maya or Siren or whatever. I don't know. I always play as a Siren. Oh, I will never fly a helicopter oh, in armor I'm ever again. You can fucking warp and you run like fast. I'm so used with like flying a, helicopters in armor like bloody jet pilots and not uh, jet planes and not being able to land the damn things. 
this and then you get in here and it's completely different there. huh yes. do you remember the book ready player one yep. they're making a movie out of it i want to make a movie out of you trouble that i'm revoking your expert tag why is that because you need to go through wow I can fly a hooey! At 18. Can't fly a KA-50, but that's, that's bloody Russian anyway. Out. I'd like to be able to fly the KA-50. You said it was eight weeks ago. Oh, eight weeks ago. Some of that yeah. Russian stuff's great, you know. I'll show my eight twenty-eight. Yeah, I said, don't worry, you were there. And I've got the... Well, I've got, actually, I've got... Out of the helicopters I've got, I've got one Huey, it was it was and I've got the KA-50 and the MI-8. So I've got two Russian helicopters and just one Ten American one. Birth. Wait, they'll bring out the Lynx. I'll have to have the Lynx, because then the Lynx got the airspeed record for helicopter. Crocodile, you can't just play when I'm not ready to play, right? That's okay, this will be a really quick run. Why I lost her really easily. Wow! Wow! I can fly a Huey! Before the patch, uh, I had like unlimited wow. speed. Wow! I, I could literally open the fucking box. And chuffed a bit? I wanted it bugged out or something, it was awesome. Before some patch, like fucking way back when. It was on, it was on my fucking. Uh, can side. I land it? That's the next question. I was there to open the box. Really well, Look at that! Oh, are you kidding me? The K-50 oh, had auto hover on. Have you played the entire PSX match? No wonder the damn thing yes. wouldn't fly. Up until before that was released, it was horrible to find shields. I farmed uh, Hyperius. Oh, the radio dude for the Hyperion thing was the only guy who dropped a shield, and I didn't farm that guy. It was so much to get one. This would be great for the Vietnam mob, wouldn't it? It's my first time. You know what it was like your first time? You probably don't. I've got to give it a little bit of left collective here, haven't I? Right, down and close. See? I got it down. Can't do that in armour. <laughs> Top left of the main menu, there's a box with nine bits in it. There's bits all over the runway now. Nice go, thanks for the follow. Uh, click that and then look. Hey, so top left of the main menu, there's a box of nine bits. Yeah, yeah, oh, you're talking to somebody else. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, that's not the yeah. I know that, that's the, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well. Well, that worked. That wasn't bad, was it? What's next? Okay, now turn the engine off. Well, I suppose... I would have to, uh... do that. Tell that to shut up, again. Do that. <laughs> uh, 
And there's going to be a load of other shit to do. <laughs> Just cut the fuel, that'll shut the engine off. And get out without taking the top of your head off. I was surprised there's no clutch 